y'all welcome back in today's video i'm really excited to be sharing with you a back to school haul i have been getting things here and there recently and just thought i would share everything that i have purchased for our new school year so a few of these items i bought at the store at target but everything else is from amazon because right now i'm currently shopping online quite a bit and everything I'm sharing, I will link in the description box if you wanna check it out for yourself. So let's go ahead and get started and I'll share with you guys what I got for our new school year. So this isn't really in any particular order, but I'm just gonna kind of run through everything. So the first item that I decided to purchase was this new set of DVDs. This is the Leapfrog, um, kind of like educational DVDs. We have a couple of these. I think we have two right now. Um, the Word Factory and the Letter Factory. So I'm really hoping that my preschooler will enjoy these DVDs and I'm sure the other kids will be excited to have new, new video options as well. The next item that I got with my five-year-old daughter in mind and that's these Roll a Word dice. I shared the Roll a Story dice in a previous video that we already have, but these are just um, dice that have different letters on them and they also have some of the basic blends and vowel teams. And so I thought this would be fun not only to roll the dice and create words together, but also if we could roll the dice and practice the letter sounds because she's going into kindergarten this year and so we're starting at the very beginning talking about all the letters and identifying the sounds that each letter makes. So I thought this would be great for her as a fun way to practice and review together um, in a way that's really hands-on. So I got these with her in mind, but again, I think the other kids will enjoy um, playing with them as well. All right, this next item is a little bit random, but I bought the kids these coloring bookmarks. The thing is for every school year, the kids always have several different books that they're working through, whether it's um, like a workbook or a textbook, and we never seem to have bookmarks. And so we always just throw in a random scrap of paper. And so I thought that this would be a really fun activity for the kids to do. I'm planning to do like a first day of school party where we're just gonna kick off the new fresh year by doing some fun things together. So coloring bookmarks, will be one of the activities that we do on our back to school day. So I think that the kids will enjoy these. They'll be able to decorate several of them and have one for each of their subject areas to just mark the place where they're at in their books. All right, I know you guys know how much we love um, educational board games and I decided to buy two new games this year to add to our collection. And the first one is called Money Bags and this is created by Learning Resources. So I think this will be really great for the kids, just reviewing um, the different coins and what they're worth and some addition and subtraction. So I think this will be a really fun money game for the kids and so I'm really hoping that they enjoy it. The second game that we're adding to our collection this year is called Word on the Street Junior. So in this game, you are drawing a card that has a question and down the center of the board is the alphabet. And the way that you win the game is by collecting eight of these letter tiles for your team. I think this game will be really great for critical thinking as well as building vocabulary. So I'm really looking forward to playing this with the kids. I hope that they enjoy it. The next item that I got for our new school year are some new dry erase boards. We had one dry erase board that I bought, I think when my daughter was in preschool and it was an old Crayola dry erase board and it was really hurting, <laughs> it was not doing well. So I decided to get some of these lap boards. They're very thin profile and essentially it just replaces the need to use um, scratch paper. We tend to use the dry erase board quite a bit for math. If there's not enough room on the page to work out the problem, then the kids will pull out a dry erase board and just work the problem on there. Sometimes we also use it when we're doing writing, if we're brainstorming ideas for things to write about. So it's really great to have these small dry erase boards, in my opinion, when you have small kids and we don't have a place in our home to do a giant <laughs> dry erase board on the wall. So this is a really great option. So I went ahead and got this set. It comes in a pack of six. And then it, I liked it because it has these really cute little square erasers. So the kids are really excited. We just pulled these out actually today and um, the kids are enjoying them already. And so I think this is gonna be a great addition to our new school year. 
Okay, the next two items are some new books that I bought for the school year. And the book is called Sing a Song of Seasons. And it's a um, poetry book. And each day of the year, there is a nature poem. So I think this will be a great book to have in our home library. And I'm really looking forward to reading it this year. All right, the next book that I got was actually a set of books. This is a series of books, it's called Light Keepers. All of these books um, contain different stories about men who have had an impact on our world. And I'm always on the lookout for books that encourage, um, you know, godly character and um, just good values and having courage and being bold and doing the right thing. Just reinforcing all of those um, things that we want our kids to know and to be when they grow up. But I am looking forward to reading these as a read aloud and just having good discussions together and for them to learn about some people who did some great things in history. All right, the next thing that I got for the kids, this is just kind of for fun. I got them some brand new erasers. Um, our pencil erasers tend to wear out pretty quickly and so I decided to get them these large erasers this year. And these are really fun because the top part of it is the actual eraser and then the bottom part has a roller that you can roll and it gathers up all the eraser, um, I don't know, shavings or whatever and gathers them into a little canister that you can empty out. And so I thought that was fun and kind of multi-purpose. So each of these looks like a little animal and so the kids are really excited um, to start using these in the new school year. All right, the last two things I'm gonna share with you guys today are not super exciting, but I got some more glue sticks. I also got some more dry erase markers because these tend to get worn out. Um, during the course of the year. So. so that is everything that I purchased for this coming school year. I'm already getting excited and I just can't wait to um, get all these things out and enjoy using them with the kids this year. Hope you guys are enjoying your summer so far and thanks as always for watching. Hope you have a great day. Bye.